our home representation of Kepler's first law using some household objects we found. And it's pretty easy to do if you were ever willing to try and replicate this yourself. So all we did is we took some nice thick poster board and then we thumbtacked um, a piece of paper to the poster board. And then around the thumbtacks we put just a rubber band. And the thumbtacks here represent the foci of the ellipse, one of them being the sun, and then the other one just being another focus. And the closer you put the foci together, the more likely your ellipse is to kind of become more circular. And um, so this pencil can represent a planet. And what our experiment basically is, is you take the rubber band and you pull the rubber band up and you kind of form a triangle. And then you just keep the pencil kind of going around, making an ellipse. You kind of want to keep it fairly tighter around the um, pins. And or the foci. Or the foci. And so once you finish drawing this, you basically understand the whole concept of Kepler's first law, which is that um, all planets orbit in the path that uh, resembles an ellipse, um, with the sun being located. Um, as one of the foci in, those, in that ellipse. And an ellipse is basically a special curve in which the sum of the distances from every point on the curve to two points is a constant.